A program is making it easier for first responders to own a home in the place they work. The program is teaming up with the Williston Police Department to help their officers buy a home. TV20's Valera Thomas tells us why Williston's deputy police chief thinks the program is beneficial to the people he serves. The Home for Heroes program gives first responders an opportunity to buy homes for a discounted price. The deputy police chief for the city of Williston says he's thankful that he found the program. Serving the Williston Police Department for 31 years, Deputy Police Chief Clay Connolly wants other police officers to make Williston their home like him. I think if, you, if you're familiar with Williston, you know that we are not the highest paid police department pretty much anywhere. Connolly was thinking about how to make officers continue serving in the city. Well, like everything else, you <laughs> Google it. I tried to find some idea that would invest the police officers we hire in the city of Williston. Connolly was searching for ways to make it affordable for officers to live in Williston when he came across real estate broker Tina Yakel, who offers the Homes for Heroes program. Connolly used the program to help sell his wife's home in Gainesville, and it only took three hours. That's pretty <laughs> stunning. It really is. Yakel offers the Homes for Heroes program as a way to show her appreciation to people working as teachers, first responders, and veterans. The program is operated by a charitable foundation and was created shortly after 9-11. I think in the way our culture is now, nobody says thank you anymore. My company is TY Realty, those are my initials, but more importantly it stands for thank you. And I think that we as a generation need to thank people for what they do. And so it's a way of just saying thank you. Connolly hopes to have the same success in Williston. We could probably put a police officer in his family or a firefighter or a teacher or any of those people that are covered by this program into a home for a substantially discounted price. Sounds like a win-win to me. For more information on how you can sign up for the Home for Heroes program, visit our website at WCJB.com. Reporting in Williston, Valera Thomas, TV20 News.